YouTube, it's a Ninja Assassin back with another food adventure. It's lunchtime, I'm so hungry, hungrier than your mom after being pregnant with you. Haha, <laughs> that's how hungry I am. Let's go check out this place close to my work. I believe it's called Tokyo Teriyaki and Walk. I've never been there, but let's go check it out. But in the meantime, how's everybody doing? Like, having a great summer? As you can see, it's a sunny day. Summer here don't last long, so I have to make sure I, you know, take advantage of it. So here we are. Let me put this on pause while I'm at the stoplight. All right, here we are. It's in the same plaza as Subway and Jimmy John's, which I've reviewed. There it is, right in front of me. See that? Tokyo Teriyaki and Walk, right next to the Pho Hiho, which I also reviewed. Wasabi Factory to my right. Billy, oh, Billy on Gourmet Burger and Fish Chips? Never had that. Let's find a parking space. YouTube, it's Asian Fee. Now I'm back with another very exciting food review. I'm actually across the street at the Phil Johnson ballpark reviewing this Tokyo Teriyaki and Walk. This was a nice little park. All right, let's get to it. Tokyo Teriyaki and Walk, they deliver. That's the phone number. Hours of operation. So let me show you what I ordered and the price. First time there, so I ordered the lunch bento. That's what it comes with. No, it says half size. So for the dinner bento, you get the whole serving, I guess. All right, let's get to it. All right, so it looks like we have garden salad with some type of dressing. And here's the good stuff. Wow, wow, when I picked this up, it felt heavy. Now that I can't complain. That means there's a lot of food in here. Whoa, that's a lot of stuff, all right. $7.95? Ooh, wee, they even give me like three packs of, wow, they got their own. I've never, I've never had these before. Check it out. Vinegar, chili oil, sweet and sour. Wow, they hooked me up. By the way, they gave me a sample of gyoza while I was waiting. That's, wow, that's that's very special though. Check it out, two gyoza, the fried shrimp tapira, the egg roll. That's the chicken. Wow, it's all wrapped up, looking all nice. They hooked me up. Well, let's try a salad first. Let's pour some of this dressing on here. It looks like it's a light type of Asian vinaigrette, perhaps. Salad looks fresh. See, there's no browning or anything like that. It's got some of this uh, cabbage, some carrots, iceberg lettuce. Wow, that dressing is pretty tasty. It's sweet. Slightly tangy, goes well with the salad, I mean the lettuce and stuff. Overall, I give this a 84%. Let's get to the good stuff. Here we go. Put some sweet and sour sauce to the side right here. Some hot chili sauce down here. Let's take a bite of this gyozo. Some sweet and sour sauce. It looks like it's freshly made, you know, not, not overly crunchy or overly deep fried. Oh, you guys hear that crunch? That's what fresh ingredients look like. Oh yeah, let's try this egg roll. Nice big egg roll. Dip some of this sweet and sour right here. Here we go. Mm-hmm. That's what fresh. This is what fresh ingredients look like. This is one of the best egg rolls I've had to go. The other ones are all taste stale, you know. This is fresh ingredients, people. I already have much respect for that place. Let's try that with shrimp. Although it's just one piece, what do you expect? It's a lunch special. Shrimp is expensive. Oh yeah, that's good. 
Once again, it's fresh. Looks like a pretty big piece. All right, let's get to the chicken teriyaki. I have some extra teriyaki sauce right here. Just pour some over that. Pour a little bit over the rice, you know. Show me that Asian love. That's what it's all about, people. White meat chicken. Wait, hold on. It's dark meat chicken. My bad. Let's separate and see exactly how much. Wow, look at that. Even though we call this a half serving, some places this is considered a one serving. Keep that in mind. So they're generous in their portions. The food is fresh. And the taste is definitely up there. Mmm. Some sesame, they put some sesame on there. Sauce is proper, legit, sweet. Right amount of salt. I tried the rice. I believe this is a uh, Japanese type of rice, you know, not the jasmine type where it's more, more loose and grainy. Japanese rice is more sticky. Hmm, that's some proper too. Wow, so let me tell you, I am very impressed with this place. First time there. Food is excellent quality, fresh, big portions. No wonder they have so many customers. Uh, so the gyoza was good, crispy, tastes right, fresh. Same with the egg roll. Chicken, large portion. Grilled right. Sauce goes perfectly with that. The rice is definitely proper again. You get all this portions. Like, this is like, even though it's lunch combo, I was expecting like small portion. This is more like a dinner. At least it can be a dinner. $7.95 is a steal. I'll definitely be back to check them out. So, yeah, guys, that's the Tokyo Teriyaki and Walk lunch combo review. Dang it, I forgot again, I forgot to give it a score. So on a scale of 1 to 100, based on the portion, the price, and the taste, all three into consideration, I give this meal a 90%. There you have it, 90%, that's right.